a bit of an afternoon free. So, I'm going to continue on with the exhaust. You can see that's settled in quite well, so that just needs a final kick over. It just needs to clean up some of the staining there. I really came out pretty good from last time, so um, I just need to finish that now. I'll work on getting rid of this staining this time. Uh, and I'll start on up here and work my way to the muffler. to get the staining off. I mean that rust pitting I won't get rid of, but that's okay. <laughs> Hopefully I can get rid of all of this staining. Uh, should be okay. Just a bit of time. Let's see how we go. Next type laps. see what the difference would be between that and that just with a little bit of treatment that's going to take a fair bit of work by the look of it unlucky <laughs> however this has progressed much further uh, as you can see this side looks pretty good the other side has a bit more of the piping on it but that's okay that's what it is I can't change that so I'll uh Still work a bit more at that, but um, I'm pretty happy with where that's gotten from the beginning of the video to now. So, that's about, I don't know, an hour put to it. Um, it's gotten it back to that. I think that's not too bad, considering. So, yeah. So I'll leave that now. Um, I think I might just let it settle, take it for a run, burn some of the shit out of it, just from the run, smell the house out, upset the missus again, that's right. And then now, I think I might see what happens with uh, this black duck, well I think it's black underneath, looks like it might be, I don't know, we shall see. So, this I suspect is going to take a fair bit of work just from the initial bit of scrubbing and mucking around on it. Uh, I threw some pre-treatment on it just to see what it had, how to react to it. It reacts okay, but um, yeah, I suspect this is going to require a ton of work. Been happy with down there, so. Looks pretty good. Anywho, 
continues. I shall get the hell into this. Also, if you're starting on other bits and you can't be bothered with your exhaust and you're actually giving this a go, galvanised stuff and coated bolts. Don't touch that with the rust buster. Same with your backing plate here. It'll tear that off and take it back to bare metal. So um, if you're going to be sort of doing work in those sort of areas, you might want to potentially either mask those up or just do everything by hand around it and just see how you go. Um, yeah, not optimal to strip all the shit off that. So yeah, just need to be careful. progress so from the rusty POS it was it's just all surface rust and grime you know all that Japan action uh, looking like this was actually painted so once I finish all the rest of this under here I actually might respray this with the right paint so I'll drop the exhaust down and um, just give this section a respray I think that's looking likely just to uh, Bring it back with some nice heat paint and whatever uh, and I might chuck some uh, heat tape just to take a bit of a bit of the action out of the uh, the diff area as well while I'm at it I'll see how I go interestingly treated the uh, muffler so it's getting there looks like the back of it was painted I'm not sure if that's standard or not or someone's just done that I'll have to have a bit of a look ask some of the guys on the forums and on the back you can see up in here still need to work but that was completely black so uh, i'll come back to that might put a bit of treatment on there but looking good so pretty happy but more so let me back out here also for this this is looking pretty done uh, i will hit some of those little areas up here just that section and just here needs a little bit of the staining like down the further did so that bottom section I finally sealed up at the start of the video um, once I get this done next time that'll get sealed as well and I might just semi seal this like I'll do something I don't know what yet just to get it until I get it sorted until I paint it I think so no looking much better Pretty happy with that. So the exhaust, the uh, muffler should come out pretty, looking pretty good once I've gotten through all of this grime and whatnot underneath it. So it looks like it's half painted on one side. So I might even see if I can gently take a bit of that off and strip the muffler back. Um, again, I'll double check and see what the go is, whether it was like that standard or not. So more to come. Anyway, I'm going to give the other side of this a wash because it's filthy. Enjoy. I'm sure most of you guys do, but uh, checking your oil, especially with these old ladies, quite frequently is a good idea. So, got the old royal purple. This thing doesn't really use any oil, but Every now and then, you chuck in about that much, if that. So, yeah, check the oil. 
see what's going on. Right, I gave it a wipe down. Let's see if we can do this one handed. Looks alright. I think we're good, fam. So, happy. The raw purple does obviously look pretty dark. Come on. But that oil is only about, I don't know, less than 500 k's old, so. But as you can see, it just looks dark. That's raw purple, so. Cool, now to wash it.